All right, so before we get started with the hands-on part of this workshop, we are going to look at all the hardware and the firmware and software that you need in order to complete the different labs. So let's look at what you need. In terms of hardware, we will be using the STM32 U083C-DK. So this is the part number of the STM32 U0 Discovery Kit. So this kit embeds uh, ST-Link, as you can see here, and this connector will connect to the ST-Link, and the ST-Link is connected to the STM32 U0. Uh, what else? We have the target connector, so all the IOs of the STM32 U0 are represented right here on this connector here, and this connector right there. Then we have uh, the Arduino in a connector right there, where you can connect some shields. We have another connector that is here where you can connect some other, let's say, external devices. This is where, for example, you can connect like an external sensor, like an air quality sensor. So the board has been designed, you know, with low power in mind. So you can do some low power uh, consumption measurements, like current measurements. So here are some uh, for example, uh, jumpers you can use where you can connect directly your emitter. Uh, you can also connect here a battery if you want to do like uh, battery powered in application. And so this is where you're going to select the power source through these jumpers right there. You have a LCD display right here connected to the LCD peripheral of the STM32 U0. You have a joystick right here connected to the STM32 U0 also. So one, two, three, four, and five positions different there. So you can use that, for example, if you want to design a user interface and jo go from one you know, menu to another. We have a temperature sensor right here. So connected to the I2C of the SM32 U0 to get a precise temperature. We also provide a touch sensing, so electrode right there. So we can have, so as I don't know if you're familiar with the SM32 U0, but you will be <laughs> at the end of this uh, workshop. But we have a touch sensing controller, so TSC. And so this is what is connected to it. And we can do a touch to detect a touch using our TSC controller. And here is a user USB connector, so Type-C also like this one. So, but this one is connected to the USB peripheral of the STM32 U0. You will also need a USB cable. So the USB cable will be like a Type-C cable. So Type-A to Type-C or Type-C to Type-C. And you will connect it right here if you want to connect to the ST-Link, you know, in order to program or debug the STM32 U0. Or you can also connect it here if you are doing some USB uh, type of application. But then you will change, you know, the jumper here for the power source to be USB instead of ST-Link. So regarding the softwares and the firmwares, here is what you need. First, you're going to need the STM32 CubeID 1.15.0 or later. Then you're going to need the STM32 CubeProg, so that's our Cube Programmer, uh, 2.16.0 or later version. In terms of firmware, uh, we will use the SM32 Cube U0, at least version 1.0.0. So all of these are available from st.com. And uh, you should have also the links directly in the getting started of the workshop, you know, the documents that we provided to you, that is uh, downloadable, you know, from the page uh, directly, or that has been provided to you by email. You should have also a zip file, so stm 32 u 0 workshopzip So this contains a copy of the presentation in PDF format, a document, so a text document where you have all the code from the different labs where you can copy and paste from it. And then we also provide uh, the reference projects. For each lab, you will have a working project that you can refer to.